Okay, let's find the greatest common factor, the GCF for 8 and 20. Here's how we do it. So the GCF, that's also called the greatest common divisor and the highest common factor. These are the same thing. I like GCF. Let's go with that. So what we'll do, we'll find the factors of 8 and 20. Look at the ones in common between 8 and 20 here and just choose the greatest one. So for 8, 1 times 8, that would equal 8, and 2 times 4, but that's it. 20, we could have 1 times 20, 2 times 10, and 4 times 5. That equals 20. So we have our factors here. Now we look at what's in common. 1, that's in common between 8 and 20. 2, that goes into 8 and 20 evenly. But 4, that's the greatest number that goes into both 8 and and 20. That's the GCF. So in answer to our question, the GCF for 8 and 20, that's 4. There are other ways you could do this, like prime factorization, but unless you have a really big number, this works pretty well. It's Dr. V, and thanks for watching.